Recently, I played Warrior Season 4 Episodes 1 and 2, and Blade Episode 1. The biggest change in the mod list this season was the combination of moves that can give the most FromSoft, Dark Souls, Elden Ring game like Seal and the choice to pursue stability. We'll talk about the stabilization part later, and first of all, let's talk about the combination of a moveset that can give a game like Feel to Romsoft, Dark Souls, Elden Ring. Currently, I'm based on three frameworks, MCON, Animated Armory, and Elden Rim Weapon Arts. Mixing animations from the creators Black and Smooth, who are currently building an animated armory-related moveset system. This combination is characterized by the following advantages. First, through the MCO system, the forward attack mechanism was realized. We've talked about this countless times before, and since you all know the benefits of this mod all too well, I've omitted the detailed explanation. Second, it uses the animated armory system, so you can use different types of weapons from the Skyrim world. The mechanics of Dar and MCO further maximize the advantages of the animated armory mod that diversifies weapons. Now, not only do you diversify the types of weapons, but you also diversify the weapon's moveset, allowing us to experience the contents of Skyrim even more abundantly. Third, with Elden Rim Weapon Arts, we have chosen a differentiated stagger system for each type of weapon. With the advent of the current SKYSA and MCO mechanisms, numerous animation creators have also appeared. Thanks to their efforts, we now have a huge selection of movesets to choose from. However, it is true that the development speed of the stagger system was slower than that of the attack moveset. There are many stagger-related mods. But the reason I chose Elden Rim Weapon Arts is because, Skyrim's stagger system that exists to date as a single system and relied on only a few common stagger animations. However, Creator Black assigned a stagger to each attack moveset. I think the implications of this are great. Because this is also in line with the direction Dara is pursuing, which means that in the future many humanoid or creature stagger animations can be created by creators, which may be customizable by the player. And I think it was a good opportunity to think about this stagger recently. I want you to think about action movies, too. The main character who attacks splendidly is important, but the supporting character who must be beaten is even more important. The main character attacks brilliantly. But think of it as always using the same animation for supporting actors being hit. Skyrim has always been that way. This definitely needs to be fixed. Because, in a way, I think that the game is also somewhat similar to the movie you direct. Fortunately, Skyrim has a huge framework called DAR, and there are a lot of talented animation creators out there. A stagger animation may also need to be developed to match the attack moveset. Above is a brief description of my thoughts on the MCO and Animated Armory and Elden Rim Weapon Arts combo and stagger. Thank you very much for watching the video till the end. Subscription like notification setting is very helpful for channel growth. See you next time.